Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. I think many of you would have seen our community post related to MCA and trust me I was equally excited when I got the news. However, I have something bonus for you guys at the end of the video so stay tuned with us. You would have seen a lot of community post that we have been recently posting of our defense minister Sri Rajnath Singh. The MCA news is also coming from there. The MCA design now have been completed including all reviews by users. As per the latest update, several parts of MCA such as antennas, stabilizer, actuators, air brake, servo control module has been developed and one of them you can see on your screen right now. Which means that the manufacturing of the first prototype of MCA has already started and several parts of the aircraft have already been built. We can expect the rollout of its prototype by 2024 for ground trials which is not far away as we are already at the end of 2021. As we have been closely tracing each and every development of this MK1, MK1A, MK2 and MK, our expected timeline for the rollout of MK prototype was somewhere in 2025. But surprisingly for us, it seems to be an year ahead of time. The possible reason for the quick rollout is the private players heavily involved in its development such as VEM technologies. If all goes as per plan, the first flight of MK can be expected to begin between 2025 and 2026. The production of MK is likely to kick start in next 7 to 8 years. ADA is reportedly looking to commence production by 2026 to 2028 and full-fledged production will commence by 2029. The Indian Air Force modernization roadmap involves the development of around 126 stealth fighters which is close to 6 squadrons consisting of 36 MK MK1 and 90 MK MK2 from 2032 onwards. The development of MK will happen in two phases. In phase 1, two squadrons of MK MK1 will be produced powered by American GE414 engines. In phase 2, the four squadrons of MK MK2 will be produced which will be advanced version of MK with 6 generation technologies and will be powered by indigenously developed engines likely to replace the imported G414 engines. Now it's time for the bonus news. It is related to Tejas MK2. It is expected that the first prototype of Tejas MK2 to be rolled out by early next year. Earlier this year, AHL has reported to have started the metal cutting of LCA Tejas MK2 program. The first rollout of Tejas MK2 can be expected in middle of next year, post which it can take its maiden flight by early 2023. Once the prototype is rolled out, it will take another 3 to 4 years for DIDO and ADA to completely test its flight control, avionics and other parameters before it's ready to enter production which seems to be likely by 2026 to 2027. The plan is to complete the production of this MK2 before MK, MK2 enters the production. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.